Welcome back. Come on in, guys. Today we are joined once again by our friend Lacey Ogan with our sponsors at Pacific Seafood. And she's here to talk all about two different types of seafood that have a lot in common. And we're even going to try them out today. It's Pacific Seafood Col Columbia River Steelhead and Columbia River King Salmon. Now at all the grocery stores available to you. Lacey, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me, Ashley. I'm excited to be back. So we know that these two things kind of they're, obviously they're different, but what do they have in common? They do. Well, so steelhead, we like to say, is a trout that thinks it's a salmon. <laughs> okay. So steelhead starts out as a trout in fresh water, and like salmon, travels out to salt water and back. But so it starts out as a trout water. So they're cousins. They're cousins. So right now it is fresh salmon season. So okay. King Salmon is fresh out of the Columbia River. We source it from Two Rivers Fish Company and they're native tribal fishery. Oh. And so they use a traditional fishing method. They get up on these huge platforms. They have these hoop nets. They have 25 foot poles and they individually catch these uh, salmon that you're seeing today. So they're catching wow. kings and cohos. It's fresh season right now. And then our steelhead, we also raise that in the Columbia River and it's available year round. So if you're a person who loves salmon, you gotta try steelhead. It's a great alternative. Expand your palate a little bit. That's awesome. I was just telling Lacey my brother loves salmon, so I might try to sneak some of these home to him. Absolutely. Now, now tell me, which one are we looking at? Like, which one is different? Exactly. So I can't even tell. I know, right? So this is our, this is the king salmon over here. We bake this in an oven at 400 degrees for about 20 minutes, depending on the thickness. Okay. And then you have a delicious rice bowl here to go, a little sriracha mayo. Looks very fancy. It is very fancy, <laughs> but it's so easy. It's just all assembly. You guys always make it easy, but it's we it do. looks like you took a lot of time. Exactly. And then here's our king fillet here, and then our steelhead fillets are on the side. So as you can see, they're really similar. The king fillet is a little bit darker, a little bit um, of that richer flavor. Steelhead's yeah. a little bit lighter in flavor. Oh, okay. Steelhead. King. 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 Gotcha. And then here we have some of our steelhead here that we've cooked up. We put it in the oven. We finished it in the pan to get the skin really crispy because we like the skin. You mm -hmm. can keep it on or off. And we're going to use this to make one of our favorites a steelhead BLT today. Well, Ooh, so you're going to okay. make it for us, Ashley. Oh, I'm going to make you're it. You're going to, yes. Okay. Cook Ashley. All right. So as we're cooking, I want you to tell me because one of these things is kind of uh, better or easier for people who aren't as familiar with seafood or yes. kind of just don't eat yes. it every day. So we always say steelhead, which we're starting with here. So we start with a little mayo on our uh, sandwich there. It's okay. We're learning, Ashley. We are. <laughs> We're going to do it. You so, know me, Lacey. You know I'm learning, girl. She's doing great. And so, um, yes, so the steelhead has a very high oil content. It's one of the highest in omega-3s. And so that makes it almost impossible to dry out. No matter what you do, you could hit that in the oven for 40 minutes. It's still going to come out moist with that big flake. Ah, I like that. And okay. king salmon is also easy, but it's not quite as high in oil content. So if you want to start, start with your steelhead and then get that fresh king. Okay, you are definitely mm -hmm. teaching me something. Because I don't eat it all the time. Yeah, I... I I can start with this. You can start okay. with this. All right, so we're going to head and take that filet there. Yes. Just take it out. Put it right here where you've got your mayo. Now Ooh. you can keep it whole like that, which looks beautiful. I like to kind of flake it just a little bit. Okay. Yeah, so just kind of get in there with your... We use a fish spatula here. Okay. You kind of flake it up there. That just makes it easier when you bite into it, and you can see that great flake we got going on there. Okay. Then like you just got it. Now it's a BLT, so we got out our bacon, tomato, and lettuce. Yes, definitely. You're going to try that out. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> We like to eat while we cook. Oh, yes. And then gonna stack it on there. Oh, I love this. And where can people out there find? I know we said it's like at all the grocery stores. It is. And, it know, is. You. Well, right now everyone is in luck because as I said, it's also coho season and Zoo Pans right now has a great special. It's fresh in stores, just fresh off the Columbia River. So go check that out for dinner tonight. Stop by your latest Zoo Pans. You want to give it a bite, Ashley? I'm going to give it a bite as we go out. Thank you so much to our sponsors <laughs> at Pacific Seafood. Got to make sure we get that in. Uh, this is not going to be cute on camera. It's going to be delicious. <laughs> Ooh! We did it! <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much, Thank Lacey. you, Ashley. Whoa. Okay. Again, thank you so much to our sponsors. <laughs>